This isn't real, is it? <laughs> this is not real. What? Is this how this fight is supposed to go? Or is this a joke? Hello, beautiful people of YouTube. It's Gio from Geo Long Place. And today we are finding out what happens after we beat Undyne. And if you haven't checked out the last video, I'm going to leave a card right here for you to click on. It's the video where we fought Undyne. It was insanely difficult. I highly recommend you click it and watch it before you proceed with this playthrough so without further ado let us ado this <laughs> let's see who we are going to find and fight this time we have just defeated undyne in the last video and this is no longer blinking i believe these lights were like shining in the pacifist playthrough there is no one here waiting for me this is where Undyne, uh, it's where I gave water to Undyne, I guess. The water cooler is still here. It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water. Yes, why not? You take a cup of water. Now I'm walking around with a cup of water, but it will probably, well, vanish. Can, can, can't I drink it? Oh, I have to be very careful. I have to... Get some items, some healing items. The water evaporated from the heat. The cup evaporated too. It must be really hot. I have no special clothes on. I should be dead. Oh, oh this is interesting. In the pacifist route, this wasn't protected by like magic or energy or whatever this is. There were two guards here. It's a force field. Oh, interesting. Already left. Oh, I'm never leaving this place. Are you kidding? Oh, but you're here. Tra la la, I am the river man. Or am I the river man? It doesn't really matter. River woman. Oh, I didn't read it right. I love to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Ride in the boat? No, thank you. Then perhaps another time. Or perhaps not. It doesn't really matter. Nothing matters to this person. This creature. This whatever it is. Now, where am I going to find the first monster in this area? As soon as I find the first, I'm going to start farming. Because in the last episode, I think I made a discovery. Like, I need to wait for the first encounter and then start farming over where... Over a little bit more where I found the first monster. I don't know if I'm correct, but that was what I felt like uh, should be the way to farm monsters i should farm where i find the first monster okay what is going on over here it's a beat up figurine of a female woman with cat ears who is that it's a computer it's accessing some kind of puzzle in snowden mm, interesting the fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda take a package of noodles definitely you got the instant noodles what does it do does it heal me? Heals HP. Comes with everything you need for a quick meal. It doesn't say how much HP it heals, and I cannot take more? Hmm. I wish I could. It's a half-empty bag of dog food. You just remembered something funny. Oh, Marathon is already here. Oh, there you are. You ugly little creature. You've made quite a name for yourself. Such infamy. I'm impressed. Oh, yes. If you're looking for Alphys, she's not here. I was about to ask, actually. While you were busy doing your um, things, she was running around evacuating people to safety. Now they're in a place where you will never get to them. Deciding not to fight you. My, my. She is really... What? She's really the only smart one, isn't she? Oh, because she decided not to fight me, you mean? Okay. Oh, how sassy. You're just itching to get your hands on me, aren't you? Well, too bad. This world needs this world needs stars more than it needs corpses. <laughs> Doodles. Well, I guess she's my next victim, maybe? It's just here to complete the look. Oh, so I cannot go through. Okay. I thought I could. It's a bathroom sign. Can I open it? No. 
I can go up though. What is here? Scientific books. They seem very dusty. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. Yes. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fight fighting beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Oh, this is what probably Undyne gave... Uh, no, actually, this is what Alphys told Undyne was uh, human history. And Undyne believed. VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They are all labeled human history. See, she was introducing Undyne. Alphys was introducing Undyne to pop culture stuff, saying it was human history. But it was all cartoons. They are not real. But Undyne doesn't know anything about humans. So she believed her. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside a book. It's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside a book. It's a comic book again. A hideous android is running to school with a toast in its mouth. Seems like it's late. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Okay. What is this? Pink goop droops from a strange machine. What does this machine do? Pink goop droops from this strange machine. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to explain. Oh, there's the woman with cat ears. Is that like an artist for Alphys? Looks like Alphys work table. Seems dusty. Okay. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. Can you guys, I, I mean, do you guys know who this person is? Who this monster is in the picture right here? If you do, please leave it in the comments below. I have no idea. Is this like an Easter egg or something? There are letters from many monsters here. Rocket, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. Did I open them? Oh, I really wanted to read them. Hmm. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. And what is this supposed to be? An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. Hmm, interesting. It's a promo poster from Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, Thank you for making my dreams come true. Oh, Metaton. A garbage can. But it's pretty cute. It's actually not. But okay. Still haven't found any monster. I guess I will start finding them right here. This area is big, if I remember correctly, so... There must be a place where things start going crazy. Oh, see? Here it is. Here's the first one. Vulcan strolls in. Pew, pew, pew. What was that sound? That was interesting. So should I start farming already? Hmm. I don't know. Should I start the farming? Let's see. 39 left. Well. Guess. Yes. I guess I'm going to start the farming right here. Oh, this is Sunder playing gets in the way. Not on purpose or anything. Well, too bad for you. You're done for. It, idiot. Oh, this is an interesting attack. Easy, easy. But I never got to... Oh, nice. That was very different. So, the farming begins. 38 left. Okay. Farming until I reach one. See you soon. This is it. We have only one left. I've been here for a while, guys. I think I deserve your like on this video as well. Please leave a like. Finally, here it is. Thunderplane gets in your way. Not on purpose or anything. It's going down. And there it is. Determination. This is it. The last monster has now been 
eliminated from this area, we can now go ahead and face the boss. Okay, before I got here, where Metaton was supposed to show up, at least he did in the pacifist route, I have to apologize because I lost part of the footage and it wasn't very, very, very significant though. But before this save point, I found the couple of guards that used to protect the entrance to uh, whatever the beginning of that area was, uh, where the force field was in the beginning of this episode. There, there were supposed to be two guards there. They were actually a couple. They liked each other a lot. And I fought them, and it was really easy. One hit kill for, to bo on both of them. So I'm sorry I didn't capture that footage because I'm stupid. Uh, but now, let's keep watching. Where am I, though? Um, left floor one, I guess. Left floor one, we go. Uh, okay. Oh, this. This is what I was talking about. This is where the two guards were in the pacifist route. If you haven't watched it, I'm going to leave a card right here. I mean, way over there. I think you can see it. And if you watch that episode, you will see that right here, the first time I come here, there are two guards protecting the entrance to this elevator. And I just found these two guards. And... They were like, oh, if you're here, then that, mean, um, that means Undyne is dead. Ooh, another force fuel. Okay. Uh, left floor three. And then I fought them. I hit each of them once. And they were gone. So nothing major happened. It's, it looks like some sort of powerful bracelet. Wait, it's just a croissant. It's a spider donut. It looks more rubbery than usual. It didn't help the spiders when I found their store. So I guess I'm going to fight the spider girl that thinks I didn't help them, their cause. Oh, I'm going in circles. Um... Should I go up first? I think I shouldn't. Let me come back. I think the spider lady is to the right. I'm not sure. Ooh. Um. Yeah, the spider lady was here. Okay, but now I'm kind of curious. If this is the spider entrance, then... What could that door be? Because as I think you noticed, even though I have played this before, doing the pacifist run... Oh, okay. It's another puzzle that is not working. I have a terrible memory. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, no. Wait. Okay, this is it. Is there anything down here, though? Mm. They still uh. wait. Should I be moving? Oh, I should be moving, I guess. Wait, I don't get it. Blue means oh, blue means stop. Wait, what is this? What is this? You stopped to smell the flowers. That was it? I don't remember that. Okay. But me not remembering something doesn't say much, does it? Because I don't remember most things. So spider entrance it is. I guess we're going to fight the spider lady. Oh, I think we will. Did you hear what she said? They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. That is me. I heard they hate spiders. I heard that they hate everybody. Um, I don't. I'm just doing this because I have to. I heard that they like to tear off their... 
tear their legs off. Oh, okay. I didn't know Chris was doing that, but okay. I heard. No, oh, I'm stuck. I'm completely stuck. Oh, there she is. She's cool. That they have some awful taste. What a shame. A human comes through and they haven't even fit. They aren't even fit to be eaten. Oh, well. Rotten ingredients can always be discarded. Oh my gosh. Muffet traps you. She looks different, doesn't she? Oh, a crit. Oh, that was easy. Okay. Oh, there's a tiny, tiny spider. Is she going to say something? Okay. She just ran off. It's very interesting how something so silent can have so much emotion. So congrats to Toby Fox for thinking about this, for coming up with this. It had a lot of emotion over there. So I was supposed to meet... Wait, these aren't, aren't stairs? I was supposed to meet Metaton over here. But I guess he really isn't fighting me. Okay. I think this is the... Ooh. I don't remember what this is. Mm hmm? I guess it's nothing. Fine. Let me go back. And explore somewhere else. Up we go. Oh. Oh, I'm already here. I guess I'm closer to the end than I had imagined. That doesn't mean it won't take a while. Please select a location. Right floor one. What is over here? Oh, I've been here. Wait, have I? I have. Okay. What is right floor two then? Have I been there already? And I forgot? Probably. Very, very likely. Uh, another force field. Never mind. Not important then. Right floor three. Are you guys hydrating yourselves? You definitely should. Okay. Let's go to the hotel then. Hey. Go up the creepy LA. I always have difficulties with this. AOA? On the right for some great deals. Okay, so this was actually going to be one of my questions. Are the two cat ladies still there? Haven't they fled? Let's see. But like, nobody came and stuff. Read. Hey, this is Braddy and this is Caddy. If you're reading this, then like bad news, you mega evil weirdo. Alphys just came here and she's taking us someplace super duper safe. But first, we gotta use up these gel pens. Yeah, chill Alphys, we don't wanna waste pens. And don't even think about stealing our stuff. Yeah, creep, leave our junk alone. Patty, it's not junk, it's really valuable. Yeah, our garbage is really valuable. Anyway, in closing, you're a total loser. Yeah, loser. <laughs> Signed, Braddy. Caddy, heart. Well, I'm not stealing. I'm taking things. Um, I don't even know if I have 
Well, but the bullets are not included. Okay, junk food heals 17 HP. Armor defense 12, attack up when worn. Probably to someone's house, a mystery key. I'm taking the mystery key. And the cowboy hat. Unless I find a chest, then I'm gonna, ooh, chest. Use the box. Yep. Let me put the bicycle, the CT, the cloudy glasses. I think that's enough. Um, and let me take the rest. Again, not stealing. Let me take the rest. Oh, I can take multiple junk food? Hmm, I guess that could be important. For healing and stuff. Since it is the only healing item I have, I, I guess I can always go back there. I don't need to... Oh, okay. I forgot that there is a limit to what I can put in the box. Hmm. Well... Before the boss, I can come back to the box and pick up whatever I think will help me the most. So let me carry the empty gun in the mystery key. Let me see if the cowboy hat is actually going to help me. Armor defense 12. This battle worn hat makes you want to grow a beard. It also raises attack by 5. How much is my attack now? 26. Let's take a look. Now let's take a look at my stats now. I guess that is what I'm gonna wear. Now my for my weapon. Um I need better defense. What does this do? Armor defense 10. Finally a protective piece of armor. Am I not wearing the tutu already? Oh, that is better, right? I'm carrying this. Okay, the termination. Hotel lobby. The potted plant is judging you for your sins. There's an inscription on this fountain. Royal Memorial Fountain built in 2000 and X. Metaton added last week. So, I wonder if I'm going to be able to go in the rooms. Let's take a look. No answer. Wait, but I have a mystery key. Can I use the mystery key? Use the mystery key, but nothing happened. It's locked from the inside. Can I use the mystery key here? Nothing happened. No answer. Mystery key. Nothing happened. It must be this one. Did you use the mystery key? Nothing happened. Well. What other door can I use it on? Speaking of doors. Scrapple the Monster commented on my latest video uh, on Undertale. That that door that we saw. That mysterious door we saw. The last episode can't actually be open anymore because I needed to avoid all the names in the credits from all the, the Kickstarter names, people who helped kickstart this game. Uh, there was a scene, there was a part of, of the credits where I could move, I think, the heart around to avoid getting hit by the names of the Kickstarters um, people, right? People who helped start this game. Why do I always get the freaks? So I think in order to open that door, I should have avoided all the names, but I couldn't. So, uh, and this happens only when you beat the game in the pacifist mode, in the pacifist route. So I don't think we are going to see what has, what lies beyond those doors here on the channel though. So feel free to, oh, 
and I forgot the name, but I'm gonna put the comment right here. I'm gonna put your name right here. But someone on the channel helped me uh, prepare for the last boss, and he said I should always carry this legendary hero thing, which, which heals me for 40 HP and brings my attack up, raises my attack in battle. So I'm taking it. Here you go, little weirdo. And then <laughs> he proceeds to smoke. Yep. Oh, I don't have room. Oh. Wait. Can I sell something to him? Oh, yes. I really want to buy your real dusty artifacts. Not talk. Well, why, why didn't you evacuate? That's an interesting question. Evacuation? You're yanking my chain, little weirdo. So what if everybody else left work? So what if nobody is buying anything? Par for the horse, little weirdo. Par for the course. Metaton. Oh, he said. Well, Metaton didn't tell me I had to work, I guess. But that's the thing. Sometimes he doesn't even call me to work until halfway into my shift. <laughs> if I don't play it safe, he's going to yell at me. Oh, so he's mean to his employees? Interesting. Okay, maybe yell is the wrong term. It's more like he has this CD album he plays that's entirely full of songs about how bad I am at my job. <gasps> oh, this is a matter for the police, man. But I guess... Well, I don't know if I'm going to kill Metaton later in this run. Huh? Everyone else is dead? Does that mean I don't have to work today? <laughs> God. It, that if we're that it were true little weirdo that it were true the english sometimes screws me over sorry little weirdo threats won't work on me i can't go to hell i'm all out of vacation days <laughs> okay um alone again i guess so i didn't know i could buy more than one legendary hero stuff i guess that's good I guess, again, I could always come back here and buy if I need. So, I'm going to carry one. I need to have one more slot for something. Cowboy hat, mystery key, instant noodles. Hmm. What will I drop for good? Okay. Okay, I, I need to manage my inventory here. Um, I cannot put anything in the box any longer, and I cannot take anything out. So, I guess I'm just gonna use an item. No. My HP is maxed out. Okay, now I have things that I can discard. I'm gonna discard a toy knife. I don't think it's gonna be useful. Okay. Um, junk food. I guess I can go back for junk food, butterscotch pie. I should always carry it because it heals me for a lot of HP. Manly bandana. I am not wearing it, so... Okay. Now the bandage. And the monster candy. Are they actually helpful? At this point in the game. Mm, bandage. 10 HP. Not very helpful. So. I'm discarding it. Or rather using it. It's kind of gooey. HP maxed out. Monster candy. Used for 10. Nah. I'm using it. And keeping two slots free. Yeah, so I have two slots free. On me and on the box. I think that's going to be enough. Um, okay, is the elevator working? Is it in use? Wait. Is it not working or is it in use? It isn't working. Hmm. What else do you have? Because he had something else here. Starfate, very popular food. Glam burger, very popular food. Heals 27 HP. The Starfate heals 14. 
steak in the shape of Metaton's face. Don't ask, please. I don't think I'm carrying that. It's too expensive. In healing 60 and 40, I don't think that will change the game a lot for me. Because the legendary hero thing, whatever it is, raises my attack in battle. So... Yeah. I guess I will need to carry more than one legendary hero item. I don't know if that's a food or what. But I'll come back if I find out that I actually need to carry more than one. Let me explore to the right first. There's nothing. I'm guessing there's nothing to the left either. Oh, there is. Ooh. Oh, okay. Is this the way? Nobody's gonna nobody is gonna be here to turn on the trap, so you can walk safely, I guess. Let's keep exploring to the right. I remember this place kinda. But it's kind of a puzzle, I guess. Kind of, kind of a labyrinth. Oh, here it is. Still no monsters to fight. So, like, we can just roam around. Great. Solve this puzzle. And the end will open. No. Hmm. But nobody came. Great. Oh. Wait. What does this say? Why not relax and have a nice snack? There's a glam burger inside the trash can. Will you take it? Nope. I'm not taking it. Traverse the northern room and the end will open. Well, we shall do that then. Oh, I thought that it would be a different kind of monster. Whims a lot and final frog it appears. Final frog at first, I guess. Nice crit. I've made my choice. Oh. Uh, why didn't the music change? Ooh, almost a crit. Oh, but he's gone. I'm earning a lot of XP and a lot of gold. More monsters? Ooh, mercenaries emerge from the shadows. I'm gonna attack the big guy first. Oh, not a crit. Ooh. Close your eyes. Alakazam! Oh, who's shooting the crosses? Is he a Christian? Interesting. It must be night night. <gasps> Ouch, he's hurt. Good night. Hocus pocus. I guess it's the magician. I don't know. One down. Alakazam. Oh, it is the magician. Is he a Christian magician? Interesting. Christian spells. Oh, he laughs when I hit him. That's kind of weird. Not a crit, but he's almost gone. Okay, final blow. Boom! Bye bye. See you soon. Again, a lot of gold. I'm guessing I'm gonna fa face one more. Batch of monsters. Three this time. What a nightmare. Final frog at first. Or maybe astigmatism first? Final frog it. I guess it doesn't matter. Don't pick on me. No regrets. Ooh. Ouch. Okay. Oh, he's strong. I should have gone for him first. Eh, okay. Shine, shine. Williams a lot says. Ooh. Almost a crit. He's gone. Nice. One more? Maybe? Wait, was that it? What happens when I do this? Hmm. 
I don't remember many things. Nobody came. Oh, so that, that was like a surprise attack or something. There's 100G inside the can. Will you take it? Yes, I will. You got 100G. Thank you. I'm very happy I did. Nobody came. What does this say? I cannot fight. I cannot think. But with patience, I will make my way through. So let's go to the right then. Wait, isn't this where I came from? Oh my god, my memory is so foggy. Ooh, okay. What is this? Determination. Core end. <gasps> let's get in the door. There he is. My, my. So you finally arrived. After our first meeting, I realized something ghastly. You're not just a threat to monsters, but humanity as well. Oh my, that's an issue. You see, I can't be a star without an audience. And besides, there are some people I want to protect. Who? Ha ha ha, eager as always, huh? But don't touch that dial. There's something you haven't accounted for. As any true fan would know, I was first created as a human eradication robot. It was only after becoming a star that I was given more photo a more photogenic body. Oh, is this where Metaton transforms? However, those original functions have never been fully removed. Come any closer and I'll be forced to show you my true form. I'm getting closer. Find it. Ready? It's showtime! <laughs> oh, I haven't seen this! This is not his form, his final form in the pacifist route. Marathon Neo blocks away? Okay. This is it then. Let's just go. No. I don't believe you, game. I don't believe you. I think I'm gonna fight you again. Guess you don't wanna join my fan club? Hmm. I don't think he's gone. I don't think Marathon is gone. I think we're still gonna face him again. I thought he would be more of a threat in this fight though. <sighs> hydrate. Remember to hydrate. Where will this lead? Guess there's only one option. Even the noise of this elevator is different. Oh, guess we're here. Oh. This can't be it. This can't be it. I'm approaching the final boss. If I'm not mistaken. This cannot be it. I don't believe it. And if this is it, I think I'm under equipped. New home? What? Oh. He leaves them in the kitchen in the hallway. What? You mean the flowers? It's a golden flower. Oh, a key. Howdy, Sarah. You finally made it home. Remember when we used to play here? I don't. I guess I lost memory. 
<laughs> Boy, today's gonna be just as fun. Oh, this is dark. You took the key and you put it in your phone's keychain. Am I seeing this bedroom for the first time? The entries are always the same. What are the entries? It's a trophy. Number one, Nose Nuzzle Champs, 98. Oh, still has the sweater. What sweater? Nothing useful. It's a king-sized bed. Macaroni art of a flower for King Dad. So I'm guessing this is Azriel's room. Am I right? Room under renovations. Wait, can I use the key here? You use the mystery key. Nothing happened. I don't think I'll have a use for this key, actually. Gifts. There's a heart-shaped locket inside, a bo inside the box. Will you take it? You got the locket. What does it do? The locket. Armor defense 99. You can feel it beating? Oh, there must be a catch. Right where it belongs. Oh, this is interesting. Knife inside the box. Will you take it? I don't think I have the space for it. You got the real knife. <gasps> I'm glad I threw away the toy knife. Real knife. Weapon attack 99. Here we are. Well. About time. Wow, I am really a killer, am I not? My drawing. Why his bed? Oh, is this Ezreal's bed? And that other bedroom was like the king's bed. So this is Frisk's room. And when I... I remember when I first woke up here in the garden. I was so scared. I couldn't feel my arms or my legs. My entire body had turned into a flower. Mom! Dad! Somebody help me! I called out. But nobody came. Oh. I'm guessing there's a key. Eventually, the king found me crying in the garden. I explained what had happened to him. Then he held me. Tara. He held me with tears in his eyes, saying, There, there. Everything is going to be alright. He was so emotional. But for some reason, I didn't feel anything at all. Yes, because you have no soul, Flowey. You are no longer Osriel. You took the key and put it in your phone's keychain. So these are the keys to the... Padlocks right here. I unlock the chain. I'm saving. Again, I feel like I'm underprepared for what's to come. But we're gonna see. I soon realized I didn't feel anything about anyone. My compassion had disappeared. And believe me, it's not like it's not like I wasn't trying. I wasted weeks in that suit with that stupid king, vainly hoping I would feel something. But it became too much for me. I ran away from home. Eventually, I reached the ruins. Inside, I found her, Sarah. I thought of all people, she could make me feel whole again. She failed. <laughs> I'm so confused. I realized those were two those two were useless. I became despondent. I just wanted to love someone. I just wanted to care about someone. Sarah, you might not believe this, but I decided I wasn't worth living anymore. Not in a world without love. Not in a world without you. So I decided to follow in your footsteps. 
I would erase myself from existence. And you know what? I succeeded. Oh. But as I left this mortal coil, I started to feel apprehensive. If you don't have a soul, what happens when you... Something primal started to burn inside me. No, I thought. I don't want to die. Then I woke up. Like it was all just a bad dream. I was back at the garden. Back at my safe point. Should I go back there? Interested, I decided to experiment. Again and again, I brought myself to the edge of death. At any point, I could have left this world continue on without me. But as long as I was determined to live, I could go back. Amazing, isn't it, Sarah? I was amazed, too. At first, I used my powers for good. I became friends with everyone. I solved other problems flawlessly. Their companionship was amusing. For a while, as I repeated, people proved themselves predictable. What would this person say if I gave them this? What would they do if I said this to them? Once you know the answer, that's it. That's all they are. Wow. It all started because I was curious. Curious what would happen if I killed them. Whoa. I don't like this, I told myself. I'm just doing this because I have to know what happens. <laughs> what an excuse. You of all people must know how liberating it is to act this way. At least we're better than those psychos that stand around and watch it happen. Those pathetic people that want to see it but are too weak to do it themselves. I bet someone like that's watching right now, aren't they? I don't know. Nowadays, even that's grown tiring. You understand, Sarah? I've done everything this world has to offer. I've read every book. I've burned every book. I've won every game. I've lost every game. I've appeased everyone. I've killed everyone. Sets of numbers, lines of dialogues. I've seen them all. But you, you're different. I never could predict you, Sarah. Ooh. When I saw you in the ruins, I didn't recognize you. I thought I could frighten you, then steal your soul. I failed. And when I tried to load my save file, it didn't work. Sarah, your determination. Somehow, it's even greater than mine. I just have one question for you, Sarah. How did you get back to the ruins from here? Wait, I know. She must have taken you when she left. And decided to give you a proper burial then. Rather than hanging out in the basement forever. But... Why then? What made you wake up? Did you hear me calling you? I'm so confused. It doesn't matter now. I'm so tired of this, Sarah. I'm tired of all these people. I'm tired of all these places. I'm tired of being a flower. Sarah, there's just one thing left I want to do. Let's finish what we started. Let's free everyone. Then... Let's let them see what humanity really is really like. That, despite it all, this world is still kill or be killed. Whoa. Then? Well, I had been entertaining a few ways to use that power. <laughs> but seeing you here changed my mind. Sarah. I think if you're around, just living in the surface of uh, world doesn't seem so bad. Ooh. 
We don't even need to leave to get them this time. The king has six of them locked away. I've tried hundreds of ways to get him to show me them. But he just won't. Sarah, I know he'll do it for you. Show me the souls he has? Why am I telling you all this? Sarah, I said it before. Even after all this time, you're still the only one that understands me. You won't give me any worthless pity. You're right, I won't. Creatures like us wouldn't hesitate to kill each other if we got in each other's way. So that's... So that's why... Are we fighting now? Ha! Ha! What's this feeling? Why am I shaking? Hey, Sarah. No hard feelings about back then, right? What is happening? Hey, what are you doing? Back off! What is going on? I've changed my mind about all this. This isn't a good idea anymore. You should go back, Sarah. This place is fine the way it is. Stop making that creepy face. This isn't funny. You've got a sick sense of humor. I don't know what's going on. Are we fighting Flower? Flowey? I have even forgotten his name. Oh. <gasps> hey, uh, you've been busy, huh? So, I've got a question for you. Do you think even the worst person can change? That everybody can be a good person if they just try? <laughs> All right. Well, here's a better question. Do you want to have a bad time? Because if you take another step forward, you are really not going to like what happens next. Ooh. Welp. Sorry, old lady. Old lady. This is why I never make promises. Oh, okay. It's not me he's talking about. It's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. On days like these, kids like you oh, should be burning in hell. Oh, wait. Before we start this fight, what is KR right there next to my health? <laughs> Oh, mama. This isn't real, is it? <laughs> this is not real. What? Are you kidding me? Is this how this fight is supposed to go? Or is this a joke? Wait. <laughs> uh, you look frustrated about something. Guess I'm pretty good at my job, huh? It's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. On days like these, kids like you should be burning in hell. Are you gonna attack the same way? Ooh. Okay, 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 okay. I gotta get it. What? <laughs> oh. Oh. What is going on? Can I skip this dialogue? Hmm, that expression. Which one? This? 
<laughs> That's the expression of someone who's died twice in a row. Oh, are you gonna mock me every time? Suffice to say, you look really unsatisfied. All right, how about we make it a third? <laughs> Please stop, just stop saying this over and over again. You can just start the fight. Kids like you should be burning in hell. Okay. Oh. Uh. Always wonder why people never use their strongest attack first. <laughs> why is my health still dropping? You feel like you're going to have a bad time. Why is my health still dropping? Am I? I'm not eating the pie. I'm not gonna eat the pie now. I'm gonna eat the junk food. You eat the junk food, recover 17 HP. It's not enough. Oh! It's impossible, isn't it? It cannot end now. Sarah, stay determined. This will be literally impossible. I am so scared. That expression... Uh, what comes after thrice anyway? I skipped, but I didn't want to skip. Wanna help me find out? Ah, oh, but this... These lines should be shorter. Oh, they are. Anyway, as I was saying, it's a nice day out. Why not relax and take a load off? I'm fighting you. You think I'm just gonna stand here and take it? Okay, so it's possible to escape the attacks. Okay, just gotta get the timing right. Okay, alright. I didn't like the weapon. Maybe if I try to hit... If I attack once, that won't be enough to hit him. So I should change my weapon. Uh, let's change it to ballet shoes again. Let's see how it goes. I know that he won't even take a lot of damage because the damage is so insignificant compared to the knife. But twice in a row oh so twice okay twice thrice <laughs> well we'll have to use it again anyways <laughs> ready oh thank you okay i lost less health here we go what you think i'm gonna stay there and take it Oh, okay. Okay. You felt your sins crawling on your back. Are you kidding me? Our report showed a massive anomaly in the time-space continuum. Timelines jumping left and right, stopping and starting. Oh, uh, stop. Uh -oh. This is gonna take forever. So, it doesn't matter if I use the ballet shoes or not. Use the box, yes. I'm gonna leave you here. I'm gonna take the cinnamon bun. Is the CT gonna help me at all? It is. Okay, I, I don't know what I'm doing. Let's just try. Let's just see what I can do. Hmm. That expression. That's the expression of someone who's died five times in a row. Oh, convenient, huh? That's one for each finger. But soon, you need a full mutant hand to count all of, the, all of your deaths. Ready?
Ooh, I'm, I almost died already. Here we go. Okay. Um. The bun. Cinnamon bunny recovered 22 HP. Oh, I'm glad they are forgiving with a bit of some of the pixels hitting the bones. Just keep attacking, it says. Why is my heart blue? What, you think I'm just gonna stand there and take it? Just keep attacking. It's not gonna work. Our reports show the massive anomaly in the time-space continuance. Time sp timelines jumping left and right, stopping and starting. Uh <clears throat> This will take forever. How? That expression? That's the expression of someone who's died six times in a row. That's the number of fingers on a mutant hand. But soon, you need to find a mutant hand with even more fingers. Is he gonna get tired of this? Is this what's gonna happen? Oh. Oh, I'm already done for. I, I, I lost already. <laughs> oh. Not forgiving this time. Let me check. Attack one, defense one. The easiest enemy can only deal one damage? That is not true at all. That is fake news. Whoa. Well, let's keep trying then. I have one... Something that I want to attempt. That expression, someone who died seven times. Seven is supposed to be a lucky number, who knows? Maybe you hit the jackpot. And that number will multiply tenfold. Ah, uh, yes, I guess I'm ready. Let's go for it. Ah, oh, no! Here we go. You feel like you're going to have a bad time. Nope. I thought that because the my attack was red, I should aim for the red stripe. It didn't work. I'm just trying things out, guys. <laughs> I'm kind of desperate here. Kind of desperate. Uh, you're going to be all right? I don't think so. I'm never going to get out of here. Is this the only way? Is this what I'm actually supposed to be doing? Someone who's died eight times in a row. I wonder what happens if I get to ten. That's the number of fingers on the spider. I don't think so. Don't spider have... <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Ready? Oh, how do I avoid the first attack? Okay, not so bad. You feel like you're going to have a bad time. Ah. So I just have to get good, huh? Okay, I think I got the timing. I'll just keep attacking. Our reports show the massive anomaly. Okay, same lines over and over. Ah, come on. I have to heal. Whoa, 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 
this attack is different. What if I attack now? Will I hit him? He went to the left this time. What if my attack is more to the right the next time? Is this like a platform I can stand on? Oh, it is. Ooh. Uh, mama! Okay. All right. 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 I'm getting further every time. Not every time, but I got further this time. That expression—that's the expression of someone who's died seven times in a row. Nope. Wait, that's definitely nine. Sorry. What? Or was it ten? <laughs> He's starting to get confused. So I, I cannot stay there. I thought I was... I thought I could stay. Here we go. Do I eat the pie? I don't feel like I should eat the pie. I feel like I should save it. Just keep attacking. Let's see where he's gonna go this time. So he went to the left. So next attack, I'm gonna try to attack him over to the right. Maybe this is it. Oh, come on. I have to survive long enough to try this strategy. Because I, I think he's evading. I might be tripping, but I think he's evading my attacks going different directions. Sometimes it goes to the left, sometimes it goes to the right. What if, I, if my attack is more to the left or more to the right? Will that hit him? Hmm. Is this what it, am I, I'm supposed to do? Ten times in a row. Hey, congrats! The big one oh. <laughs> Let's invite all your friends over for a big shinding? We can have a pie and hot dogs and... Mm, wait, something's not right. You don't have any friends. Ready? Yep. Okay. <clears throat> Here we go. I guess. Let's see where he's going to evade to. Mm, no, that is not it. That is not it then. Ah, oh, come on. Maybe I just have to survive. Just keep attacking. Ah. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I don't think I'll be able to count very well from here, he says. Count for me, okay? We'll start from 12. <laughs> I like him very much. Oh, this is almost impossible to evade. Here we go. Okay. What is happening? Okay. I'm gonna use a pie. I don't care. I 
have to go further. Until suddenly, everything ends. Ooh. Nice, nice, nice. Further than the previous times. <laughs> That's your fault, isn't it? Oh no! Sand's movements grow a little weirier. Okay, 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 okay. Junk food. Okay. Ooh. Oh, this is tricky. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna attack. You can't understand how this feels. Oh. All right. As you can see, my hair looks a bit different because it's sweaty because I just I just came back from my morning walk. Well. It's been three days since I fought Sans for the first time. You just seen, you have just seen the reaction, right, to the battle. It's been three days. I've been trying to record the ending of this fight for three days. I'm gonna show you the screen. Calm down, dudes. Calm down. I lost the recordings. Actually, I didn't. I recorded without my microphone audio. For three days, I had almost like three hours of footage without any microphone audio. So as you can see, I have improved a little bit. Maybe that's that has something to do with me fighting this guy for three days? I think so. I think so. So, not only did I fight this guy for three days, but I won the fight. And I beat the game. And the game erases your save file, right? So, in order for me to get to this point again, because I, of course, I only found out about uh, uh, me not having the audio on my microphone in the recordings after I put all the video files in my video editor software, in my video editing software, I beat the game. My file was erased, my save file was erased. And then, to get to this point in the game again, yes, I had to replay the entire genocide route. So yeah, that's why this video took a little bit longer than the previous ones, right? You might be wondering, oh, so why did, you t did it take you so long? This is why. Because I had to replay the entire game off camera so you guys could see me beat Sans. And I will. Oh, I will. I will beat Sans. So you will also notice that due to that fact, me having to replay the game, my inventory looks a little bit different. I now have some other items that I didn't have in the previous run. But I beat Sans for the first time uh, in those recordings that I did without my microphone audio with the items I had, right? So it is entirely possible to beat Sans without snow peas, without instant noodles. It is totally possible. It just takes you, you <laughs> three days if you have that time. Okay, you can try. You can keep trying. So I have my inventory full of healing items, different healing items than the previous run. And some of them heal you up to full health, like the instant noodles and the pie. So I am not worried about my damage right here, because I will probably get to the second part of the fight without having to heal. I will probably get, again, emphasis on the word, in the word, probably. If I take one more damage now, I'm done. But I think this is it. No, it's not it. Okay, let's focus right now. Oh, the late attacks. This one always gets me, but not this time. I think this is it. Okay, so now I have an opportunity to heal up to full, and now the second phase of the fight starts, where he throws 
very random attacks at you and i have been able to learn i was able to learn quite a few of the attacks some of them i still can escape from that's why it is important right now to heal up the full now he's saying i know you didn't answer me before but somewhere in there i can feel it there's a glimmer of a good person inside you the memory of someone who wanted to do the right thing someone who in another time might have even been a friend so he's talking about the pacifist route right because before this i did the pacifist route but it's cool because i have actually not done the pacifist route in this save file so this is a a, a, a fixed line of dialogue that he says but i was a friend of his in the pacifist route and if you haven't watched i highly recommend i will leave a playlist at the end of the video come on buddy do you remember me Please, if you're listening, let's forget all this, okay? Just lay down your weapon and, well, my job will be a lot easier. So Sans is now sparing me. I have never tried to spare him, but I am pretty sure, knowing about this game, that this is a troll move. So I am not going to spare him because this isn't the genocide route. It will probably bite back at me i am going to take the opportunity to heal up to full because he is not taking his turn to attack me so i have snow peace i legendary hero sandwiches instant noodles steak and another legendary hero so the steak is the one that heals like 60 legendary hero sandwiches don't heal as much snow peace heals me up to full i guess and also so does the pie no, the snow piece doesn't heal me up to four. So right now, I'm not going to heal up to four. I'm going to try this strategy. I'm not going to heal up to four because I kind of know how to avoid some of these attacks that he throws at me in the second phase. So I'm going to heal. I will take another opportunity to heal before the final attack, which is insane. So wish me luck. I feel like I can do it, but hey, everything can happen. Wish me luck. I can actually heal twice, so I'm gonna go ahead and take a legendary hero sandwich. Heal almost up to full. You can see that he isn't attacking me, even though I healed twice. He's still sparing me. I will go ahead and attack, and he's going to avoid my attack. Well, it was worth a shot. Guess you like doing things the hard way, huh? Get ready for this, folks. This is crazy. Now, can you see this bone right here? Going right and left, right and left. Well, when I select my, 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 my option down here, the heart icon is going to go up there for me to select my action. If that bone hits me, I take damage. So I'm going to try to do things as fast as possible to avoid getting hit by that bone over there. Like this. And you think that's the only thing different that he's going to throw at me? Well, sounds strange. But before all this, I was secretly hoping we could be friends. I always thought the Anomaly was doing this because they were unhappy. And then, they got what they wanted, they would stop all this. Ugh. This looks difficult, but it isn't actually. The bone is still there. He's still avoiding my attacks. And maybe all they needed was, I don't know, some good food, some bad laughs, some nice friends. Uh, this one is tricky. Ooh, look at these. Down below. I have to avoid them going right and left, right and left, right and left. Felt like a turning point, it says. Fight! But that's ridiculous, right? Yeah, you're the type of person who won't ever be happy. Ugh. Okay, took some damage there. Wasn't paying a lot of attention. Felt like a turning point. I'm gonna attack again. Yeah. Miss. 
you will keep consuming timelines over and over until... Well, hey, take it from me, kid. Someday, you gotta learn when to quit. Oh. Ooh, and now he's throwing me the bone up there and the ones below here. I have to be very careful. I kind of want to heal, but I won't. Let's see where I can go with this. Because I have to keep attacking in order for this fight to end. I'm gonna heal. Oh, no, 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 no. Um, I need to heal up to full, so I'm gonna take the... Uh, actually, I don't need to heal up to full. The legendary hero sandwich. And now, if I heal, he's gonna kind of... Like, this round doesn't count if I heal. Because I have to get a certain... This... I found out... I've been playing this for three days, guys. So I found out all about this by playing multiple times in a row. So if I heal, it's like the round doesn't count, you know? Because I have to have a specific uh, uh, amount of tries for this fight to progress, in fact. Otherwise, it won't progress. If I keep healing after each of his attacks, it's like the round... They, they just don't go forward, you know? And that day is today. Oh, this one was tough to learn, guys. <laughs> Damage. Ooh, I forgot about this. I cannot celebrate after each round. I can't. Reading this doesn't seem like the best use of your time. It isn't, indeed. Because, you see, all this fighting is really tiring me out. Yes. Ooh, the random attacks. Uh, hey. Oh, no, he took damage. Ooh. Sans is starting to look really tired. This is good. I am progressing. I'm not gonna heal. I'm attacking. Oh, no, I took damage. And if you keep pushing me, then I'll be forced to use my special attack. Oh, this is where things start get, oh, getting a little bit crazy. Oh, no. Some of these attacks, I feel like they are very hard to avoid. Sans is preparing something. I have to heal up to full before his final attack. And I think I learned when it is gonna happen. So let's see. Uh, took some free damage there that I shouldn't have taken. Yeah, my special attack. Sounds familiar? Well, get ready, because after the next move, I'm going to use it. So after this, I am going to try to heal up to full. I have to survive this though. So if you don't want to see it now, would be a good time to die. Well, too bad. You threw... Ah! I was gonna say this attack was easy to avoid. Ooh, I have to eat the pie. I need to heal up to full. So, the pie it is, because I have one HP left. I need to start the final attack with full health, because it is insane, you have no idea. And I'm sorry I'm not showing you my first reaction to this second phase of the fight, it's because I lost the recording. You ate the Butterscotch Pie. Your HP was maxed out. Okay, now he's going to repeat because you will see that he's not gonna say anything to me, so this round doesn't count. I have to survive the next round and keep my health the maximum I can. Oh, and he threw me this one, which is difficult to escape from. Ooh, I survived. Full health. Attacking. Ooh, this is it. Oh, wish me luck, guys. Well, here goes nothing. Cross your fingers. Ah, this is crazy. Are you ready? No, I'm not. Survive this, and I'll show you my special attack. Ooh, wish me luck, folks. Wish me luck. Wish me luck. Ooh, Ooh look at my health. Ooh. 
No, don't die, don't die, don't die! to do it all over again. Well, at least you were able to see how crazy the second phase gets. Let's do it again. If I sound excited, I really wish I could have shown you the footage of me fighting this guy for the last three days. I was not excited, I can guarantee. I was extremely, extremely frustrated. Ah, by the way, it doesn't matter where the bar is, you, you will miss every attack, so... You don't even have to bother... Um, like, hitting a perfect attack. I can just do this every time to save me some milliseconds. And this is, for some reason, one of the hardest attacks to avoid. It is his second attack. I was never able to avoid it every single time. Like maybe once or twice I was able to avoid every single hit. But other than that, nope. Ooh. Stick with me guys, stick with me. This fight is long. I'm gonna start skipping his dialogue because You've already seen what he says, nothing is gonna change. So I'm gonna start skipping his dialogue because I just wanna get through this and finish the game. Uh, nah! Didn't have to take damage there. This is the second attack like that I always mess up. This took me... <laughs> you have no idea. This took me three days to learn. Sometimes I will get really lucky at, at this attack specifically. Oh no. Three hit for him. I don't care how much damage I take because I'll always have an opportunity to heal once he starts blabbering about me being a friend in the past, blah 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 blah. I'll always have an opportunity to heal up to full health. But what I don't want to do is heal before that phase. So even if I'm like right now, I'm at one health point. But I don't care. If I have to restart, I don't care. But believe me, I cared a lot in the past few days. So this is why I don't care. Because now I have the opportunity to heal. He's going to tell me how much uh, he remembers me being a friend in the past. Blah, blah, blah. So I'm going to go ahead and take two legendary hero sandwiches. Yeah. And then I'm going to attack. Let's go. Second phase begins. Wish me luck. Well, it was worth a shot. Sometimes these are easy, sometimes these are extremely difficult. Oh no. Okay. I, I already know that after the third attack in the second phase, he starts throwing these bones down here in the uh, fight act item and mercy buttons. So you see that ah, this one is difficult. Ooh, the reverse one. Now, see? That's it. This is when he starts throwing me these. And then I believe that 
in the fifth attack in the second phase he starts throwing all he starts throwing all the bones so the one up top and the ones below i am not sure there is a trick to this one that i learned it doesn't work every time but it works most of the time you can kind of see out of the corner of your eye where he's throwing you like milliseconds before your heart actually goes to the place he's throwing you so you can prepare your jump like see if you can catch it think like it's literally milliseconds before he does a movement with his hand you just have to press the the opposite direction where his hand moves to I can't speak English, guys. I'm, a, I'm an English teacher. But in these moments of tension, I just can't. It's too much to think about. It's too much brain processing. I'm gonna heal because I don't like where this is going. So I'm gonna use the Snopes. I know I'm gonna lose a round, but I would rather lose a round and suffer a lot of damage in the next one. Ah, sometimes it's impossible to avoid, I feel like. Oh, gosh. Ooh. Nice, I survived. Okay. You just have to have patience. And press the button to fight. Right at the moment the bone goes away. This is gonna be forced to use his special attack, he said. Sometimes though, as you could see, I don't know if you could, he doesn't move his hand. And your heart just goes where he wants, so it's difficult to predict. My special attack sounds familiar. Get ready, because after this next move, I'm going to use it. So we're gonna survive this, heal up to full, and try to survive his final attack. See? He didn't move. Okay. Healing up to full. I'm taking the pie. So that round doesn't count. I wish I didn't lose health here, but okay. Wish me luck, guys. Here goes nothing. Are you ready? Nice. Oh no, three hits for him. Yes. Middle. Ooh. Oh no. Get closer to the middle, everybody. Get closer to the middle. That's it. It's time for my special attack. Are you ready? Here goes nothing. Yep. That's right. It's literally nothing. And it's not gonna be anything either. <laughs> you get it? I know I can't beat you. One of your turns, you're just gonna kill me. So, um, I've decided it's not gonna be your turn, ever. I'm just gonna keep having my turn until you give up. Even if it means we have to stand here until the end of time. Capiche? I guess we're staying here, then. You get bored here. If you haven't gotten bored already, I mean. And then, 
you will finally quit. I'm exhausted. I've been fighting this guy for four days. I know your type. You're very determined, aren't you? You never give up. Even if there's absolutely no benefit to persevering whatsoever. If I can make that clear, no matter what, you just keep going. Not out of any desire for good or evil, but just because you think you can. And because you can, you have to. But now, you've reached the end. There is nothing left for you now. So, in my personal opinion, the most determined thing you can do here is to completely give up. And... Do literally anything else. Well, I'm closing the window then. Stay here, Sans. Sleep. It's like my baby. That is it. And no, he's not dead. He's just asleep. And then, do you want to see what I found out I had to do? Look at this, because I can't do anything else other than stay here, right? Now, actually, I wonder what happens if I just stay here and don't move. But I'm not going to test this right now. What I learned is that if I touch the borders of this square, nothing happens. Except if I touch this. Look what happened. Oh, I can keep pushing it and pushing it. All the way to the left. And I wish you guys could see my reaction to this in real time. But now I can't push it any further. So I tried going up and nothing happens. I tried going back right. Nothing happens. But when I tried going down, I understood. This is what the game wants me to do. It wants my heart over here so I can select the fight button. And then... We fight. And he avoids my attack. But at no cost. It wasn't worth it for him. He tried, but I was faster. And then... So... Guess that's it, huh? Just don't say I didn't warn you. Welp, I'm going to grill beast. And then he slowly goes away. Bleeding. Now, if you answer me how a skeleton bleeds, I'll be very glad to know. Papyrus, do you want anything? I think he lost his mind because Papyrus is already gone. And now I'm level 20 and my HP is up to 99. And we can proceed with the game. Sad that Sans no longer exists. Now, if I go back to Grillby's, what happened? That is an interesting question. And if I go here, just to, I mean, satisfy your curiosity, nothing has changed. It's the same. It's, a comf it's as comfortable as it looks. Here are the souls 
that they've collected, the human souls that they've collected. And now, get ready for what's next, because it's all so crazy. Curious. I've never seen a plant cry before. Huh? You must be the one that Flower just warned me about. Howdy. Um, what kind of monster are you? Sorry, I cannot tell. Well, we can always... And it wasn't me. Now, now. There's no need to fight. Why not settle this over a nice cup of tea? I didn't attack. It wasn't me. Why you... Ooh. Asgore's gone. The king is gone. See? I've never betrayed you. It was all a trick, you see. I was waiting to kill him for you. After all, it's me, your best friend. I'm helpful. I can be useful to you. I promise I won't get in your way. I can help. I can. I can. Please don't kill me. Boom. Ah, I am a terrible person. And no, I am not doing anything. This isn't me. This is the game. Greetings. I am Sarah. Sarah. The demon that comes when people call its name. It doesn't matter when. It doesn't matter where. Time after time, I will appear. And with your help, we will eradicate the enemy and become strong. HP, attack, defense, gold, experience, love. Every time a number increases, that feeling, that's me, Sarah. But you and I are not the same, are we? This soul resonates with a strange feeling. There is a reason you continue to recreate this world. Oh, so these lines are different than the first time because I have done this twice. There is a reason you continue to destroy it. You, you are wrecked with perverted sentimentality. Hmm. I cannot understand these feelings anymore. Despite this, I feel obligated to suggest, could you choose to create this world once more? Oh, it's not a question. Once more, another path would be better suited. Now, partner, let us send this world back into the abyss. Erase or do not erase. So I was given this choice the first time and I've selected erase. I wonder if anything will be different. And because I selected erase, my game was completely erased. In fact, so the lines were a little bit different from the first time as you, uh, if you know Undertale, you, you might have expected. But again, the explanation is because I have lost my files due to me not recording the audio and I had to do this path again. That's why she says 
a different path would be better suited, right? So somehow she knows that I have done this before, even though the file was deleted. It probably wasn't, but okay. I'm gonna select Siri Rays and I'm gonna see if I'm gonna get the same thing I got the, th the last time. I erased. You are a great partner. Ooh, look at her eyes. We'll be together forever. Won't we? And she kills me! And then I'm back to this screen. And then I found out that if I go ahead and open the game again, look at what happens. Wait. My file has been erased. Right? But the first time, it wasn't exactly like this. The first time that this happened, which is what I was expecting to happen right now so I could show you, is once you open the game again, after the first time this happens and you cho if chosen to erase the file, the, 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 the world, you open the game to a black screen and nothing happens and you just hear the sound of wind. And if you stay on that screen for 10 minutes, this demon talks to you again and suggests recreating the world so you could choose like a different path. And then this is the screen that you see after waiting for like 10 minutes. Well, this was my experience with the genocide route. It was a little bit confusing and messy because I messed up a few things, but I hope you had a lot of fun, as much fun as I did recording this game to you undertale is done unless there is something else that i don't know and that i should explore if there is please leave it in the comments down below and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you aren't subscribed yet just check the bell right here and see if there says subscribed or not and if you're not subscribed please consider doing it we'll have tons of other types of videos in this game uh on this channel and i'm gonna leave a few playlists for you to watch other games that i have played here and also the pacifist route will be right over here so if you haven't watched it yet take a look and i'll see you guys in the next video thank you for following me through this journey bye bye